Michelle at My Everyday Wife Life and this is the $5 Goodwill Challenge put on by Hillary at my so-called home. And I watched her video this morning and um, she said this was the 16th edition of the Goodwill Challenge. I've been loving doing this challenge. I, After she said that, I calculated it up and I, this will be my 10th challenge. So I will put a list, a, a playlist down below of all of my um, Goodwill Challenges if you care to watch. And Hillary is putting together a playlist for everybody that is participating. There is a ton of people. I love this challenge because I get to see new channels and new people. And uh, it's always fun to do that, to seek out new people. You can see behind me, I have just a little bit of fall that I did um, the other day. I have just got out my fall stuff out of the attic this morning. Hubby got it out this morning. So... Other than the table, the Goodwill Challenge is all I have. So, um, if you're not subscribed to my channel, subscribe to my channel because in the next couple of weeks, I'm going to be doing a ton of videos of all of my fall stuff because I have five bins <laughs> that we got out of the attic that I will be doing. So, but uh, let me stop talking and show you what I got for this challenge. Okay, this is what I got for this challenge. I had went several weeks ago and a couple of times to the Goodwill because anticipation of this challenge, I knew it was coming up and I didn't want to wait till the last minute like I always do. And here I am videoing this video, uh, this challenge here the morning of the challenge. Still haven't got it up, but anyway. So I found this little, um, I don't know what, it's a vase. I guess um, well that's what I'm going to use it for and it kind of looks farmhouse ish and I really like the little handles on the side of it and it was $2.99 and it's been a while since it's been several weeks since I bought this but I want to say this was half price it was yellow uh, tag day so I got that for $1.50 now I didn't really want to get a whole lot of things I was going to be happy with this and go home, but then I saw these two little things. Um, they're two little mini pie dishes. Now, I won't make pie with it um, because I don't eat gluten, so <laughs> so those were $1.99 each, so with that, they that was $5.50 that I spent. But I will do maybe um, a gluten-free chicken pot pie in it or unless I could figure out how to make a gluten-free pie I might do that or I'm going to make um apple uh, apple crisp I don't even I don't even know what you call it you know with oatmeal and apples and cinnamon and sugar and all that and I'm going to make two little individual things for me and my hubby I thought they were cute I liked uh, their red on the bottom and I do have a couple other dishes that are the same thing with this, the red on the bottom there. Let me show you what I did with this vase. First, I want to show you, uh, when I saw that vase, I thought I would pair it with this picture. This picture I got from Target that I got, and I put some cotton stems in it. And, um, I don't know, I decided to separate it and do it on its own. But it would match this, so... I change my decor up all the time. I might move it around. Let me show you what I did with it today, though. Okay, this is what I did with the uh, vase. I put it on this tray. This is in my kitchen, as you can see. I love this tray. Um, I don't know where I got it a couple years ago. And I put some fresh flowers in it that I bought from Publix. And I've been buying myself fresh flowers about every week, every two weeks. Since May of this year, since my son sent me some flowers, and I'm like, you know what, I'm just going to start buying myself fresh flowers um, every so often. So I put the vase on this tray, and I have some books here. These are my husband's favorite books. He's an avid reader. I am not, but I love the way this looks um, on here, stacked up like this. And I have bought this apple from, I want to say, there's no sticker on it. I want to say I got it from Target last year. So, uh, and then I could put a candle here, but I went ahead and put this little jar. I bought this for my tablescape um, uh, 
but I just I haven't used it for my table scape, so I decided to put it here, and guess what's in there? <laughs> Some chocolate chips. We don't eat candy, but we love to eat the Ghirardelli 60% uh, chocolate chips, so I just put a few in there, but I could change this out and put in a candle there, and so I really like how that looks. It's simple, it's sweet, and I have not really done any other decor other than my tablescape. And so guys, if you, well, I'm doing my tablescape um, collab on this Wednesday. So I thought that would be a good opportunity to invite you. I have done an open invite. So you guys can um, kind of come on over on Wednesday and post your tablescape and join the collab. Um, I will leave a link below to the invite and it tells you all the information about the, the collab. So just post it on Wednesday. And if, if you're not subscribed to my channel, you might want to click that button right now because this is all my fall stuff that I'm going to be putting out over the next couple of weeks. Hopefully this week I'll get out most of it and I'll be posting a video. I also have another video coming up on Friday. It is a collab video with uh, Kimberly Davis with Diva Designing on a Don. Okay. So again, check the links below because Hillary is put putting together a playlist. I can't wait to watch everybody. I think I've watched six or seven videos already this morning while I was putting this together. Um, yeah, so that's it. Happy fall, y'all, and enjoy your day. Mm -hmm.